it's me, K10. Oh my goodness. Hi. Hello. Hi, everybody. This is my friend Kennedy. Hello, everybody. <laughs> and Kennedy, how's it going? Good. I'm going to go to a sleepover. <gasps> You're going to a sleepover tonight? Yeah, but first I want to do something fun before I leave. You want to do something fun before you leave? Yes. And we said we would hang out today, so wait a minute. This gives me a clever idea for a craft afternoon. Kennedy, we can make a fortune finder that you can play with everybody at your sleepover tonight. Yeah! Awesome, all right, let's get crafting. Come on, come on, this way. Whoa, whoa! All right, are you ready to make a fortune finder? Yeah. Wonderful, me too. So the first thing we need to do is pick a piece of paper. I want this color. Ooh, all right. Well, maybe I'll choose this color. That's plain. I know, it's plain, but I'm gonna decorate it with markers later. And then it won't be anymore. Exactly. So I'll move this to the side. And so the first things first we need to do is we need to make a square. And is this a square? No. No. It's a rectangle. It's a rectangle. So here's how we make it a square. Take the corner. Take the corner. We'll use scissors in a second. And bring it across. Like this? Yeah. And make sure that that corner really lines up. So you might be a little bit over here. That's OK. So like just like that. Do you see that? Now press it down. Press, press, press. And this, great. So now what you're gonna do This is, doesn't really look like one. It doesn't look like a square just yet. But what we're gonna do next is fold this piece. Fold this piece. Over like that. Mm-hmm. And use your thumb. To your seal thumb it off. To seal it off. So now what you're gonna do is open it up. Open it up. And you're gonna have a line that you wanna cut. So cut along that line right there, okay? Cutty, cutty. Cutty, cutty. And I'm going to use my thumb to do a little rippy, rippy. Awesome. So now, what shape do you have? Square. A square. Now to make our fortune finder. So we have this beautiful line going across. So we want to make another line going across. Wait, so bring what? this. Bring this end to touch there. All the way across and try to line it up the very best you can. Like this? Yep, yeah, you're doing great. And then use that thumb to make this nice, make and a nice line. And seal. Seal it up. If we fold it in half, what shape does that make? Triangle. What? I love all of these shapes. Yeah, me too. So what we're gonna do is we're going to take the corner. This corner? Any corner and you're gonna fold it to the middle. Like this. Yep, and seal it off. Seal it with your thumb. Seal it with your thumb. And then turn it around. Wait. Yep, make sure that's sealed. There you go, and then now take this side and uh, do the thing. same. Yeah, you want the line to match. Kinda right looks like an airplane we're making. I know, but it's gonna be different. Now what we're gonna do is flip it over. Flip. How many squares are on here? Four. So take a corner. Take a corner. And you wanna fold that corner right to the middle. And there. Perfect. So now what we're gonna do is I'll go fold over. this. Fold it like a triangle. Yep, so fold it together. So. Like that. And then fold it like that. Press. Yep. Oh, this is nice. It's good to have a grown up to help for this. And then fold this like that. And press, 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 press. So I'm going to put my fingers in each one of these. It looks like origami. Yeah, it's, it is origami. And oh. do you see? My fingers are going in over here. I made one. You made one, yeah. All right, and then. 
I can <laughs> play with it. Exactly. So see, now, and the first time it's made, it's like a little bit, you gotta like, you gotta kind of press it a bit. So now let's do yours. So, uh, put, so kind of you have to bring them together. Now put a finger in, yeah, one there. Yeah, and then, there we go. I think we got it. <gasps> Yay. Okay, now, Take your pincher fingers. Pinch, pinch, pinch. Pinch, and then you want to pinch in there. Pinch, pinch, pinch. So bring it together, close it, and then open it this way. One, and then open it One, this way. Two. Yeah. One, two. One, two. There you go. So now this is our Can fourth. I write my name on it? You totally can write your name on it. But what I think we should do first is we gotta start doing our fortunes. So the first thing we should do. Should we write one, two, three, four? You got it. So what we're gonna do is. It's a block. Yeah, so let's grab a markers. You can just dump all those markers out if you want. Messy. We can be a little messy, cause we're crafting. Whoa! Crafting is messy. Crafting is messy. Okay. I need black. <laughs> okay. So, one. Yeah. And so each triangle, I like to do like this. Like, so you do like one, two, we're gonna make eight numbers. How many numbers do you have on yours? Eight. I have eight numbers on mine too. So, what we will do first is we can write different colors. You wanna write on there? I'll hold it for you. R E D. Nice. Now, which is the next color that we should put on here? Green. Green. Love it. G R E E N. Green. What is the next one? Go. Purple. Purple. That is a fun color to say. Do you know how to spell purple? G R P L E. Yeah, purple. So, what is the last one going to be? Blue, I know how to spell blue. Ooh, and that is a beautiful color of blue. B L U. Yeah, B L U E. So each number gets a fortune. It's the game show that everybody loves. It's Fortune Finder. Okay. Pick a color. I pick red. R E D. Okay. Pick a number. I pick four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Pick a number. One. One. I pick number seven. Okay. What is my fortune? What is my fortune? You are pretty and smart. Ah! <laughs> Yay! Isn't that so fun? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Are you ready? Yeah. So which color do you pick? Um, pink. P-I-N-K. What number do you pick? Um, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. What number do you pick? One. One. What number do you pick? Eight. Eight? Okay, this is your fortune, whatever I say. You are so nice and caring. <laughs> well, you are so nice and caring for coming over and crafting with me. Thank you for helping me make it. You're welcome, and thank you for joining us, too. Bye! Thank you so much for watching K10's Crafternoon. If you love making crafts as much as I do, and you love making them with me, make sure to subscribe to my channel on YouTube at K10 Crafternoon. Make sure you ask a parent to help you out.